We've got oh, our, our first, our first yeah. uh, Dr. Gary Hello, Dr. Hinshaw. Hinshaw. Hi. Hi. We are. Hi. We have a, a live stream going on yeah. right now. Um, so, Dr. Hinshaw, tell us how it feels to uh, to be here at the Breakthrough Prize. It's an amazing honor to be uh, recognized with all of these colleagues, and it's uh, an, an amazing team I was able to work with and a once in a lifetime experience. It's Can you tell us a little bit about your team, about the the science that you've been doing? Sure. There was a team of 27 of us, and we measured the oldest light in the universe. Mm -hmm. We took the baby picture of the universe and learned about what it's made of, how old it is, and a little bit about how it began. And so, so. this is the WMAP team. That's correct. And uh, how? can you tell us what WMAP stands for? Because as a physicist myself, okay, I didn't know. I just I knew it was an acronym. It's and an it, acronym. It, it happens to, to match out with MAP, which yes. is convenient. Yes, and it started out with, and MAP was specifically chosen as an acronym. It means microwave anisotropy probe. Mm -hmm. You learned to say that quickly. <laughs> But I feel like it sounds like the definition of big data, or you must have had so much data to process. How did you even go start about that? Uh, we, we started 20 years ago, and we, we simulated this whole concept to start with on the computer, and that was really the first, that was the beginning of the whole process. And, and so we've been thinking about data for 20 years, and, and then we went and got Went and measured it, then finally. So and it's real now. So it's it's an actual baby picture of the universe after 15 years of toil. Of the entire so, universe, mind yes, you, indeed. the entire universe. Yes, it's quite quite amazing. So, very exciting. Yes. Well, congratulations thank on, you very on uh, much. being it's, part of the prize. And it's fabulous to be here. Thank so, you for chatting with you. us. My pleasure. Okay. Good luck tonight.